Libra, it's Suzanne with Sunny Forest Tarot here to do a little weekly reading on confessions. So what somebody might confess to you if they had the courage, if they if they found it within themselves to share who they truly were. All right, so that's our first deck. You can personalize the reading by pausing this and thinking about a particular situation and a particular person that you would like to hear from. All right, let's get the tarot and we'll be all set. All right, so let's take a look at what this person would confess to you. What is the first thing they would confess to you? Why don't they love me? Why don't you love me is what that is saying. So this person feels that why they might not be lovable or loved by you is because of their arrogance. Okay. All right. So let's see what that's about. <clears throat> Queen of Swords. That is Libra energy. Eight of Wands. Ace of Swords. So I feel like um, they would admit to you that they think that you don't love them because of their arrogance. All right. And I feel like that arrogance shows up in how this person communicates their truth. All right. So this person might be what you what they might um, be thinking is their arrogance you might take as confidence um, you might have cut off communication be because of this <clears throat> let's see I want to clarify this all right so magician and what else Knight of Pentacles yeah yeah I feel like you cut off something that felt really magical at some point. You guys might have had some really great um, communication that was very truthful, very honest, very direct. And this person is convinced that you may not have returned their feelings because you might have thought they were arrogant is what I'm getting. All right, so what else would this person confess to you? Why I noticed you? Why did this person notice you? Because you're a mystery to them. All right, this person feels like you in some way are a mystery. Um, you might have left this person. You might have cut this person off. You might have stopped all communication. So let's see, why they noticed you is because you're a mystery tower and you pulled the rug out from under them, the tower. You know, they fell for you. You might have fallen for each other. And I almost feel like that's a confusing energy. It's, um, it was unexpected. You might have, you might have changed on a dime. You might have done something very, very unexpected when it came to how you, I feel like you passionately communicated something in maybe an immature way. Um, about what? A decision that you made. You, you pulled the rug out. This person wasn't expecting, mystery, this person wasn't expecting you to do something that felt very abrupt Okay, some type of abrupt communication about a decision that you made, that Queen of Swords energy. It was like one day things were good, the next day, phew, done. All right, so what else? And I feel like it really affected this person. What else would they um, confess to you? The chaos I created came from... How weak in the knees I was when it came to you. So that's love. 
So the chaos that this person created, and you might have cut this person off because of the chaos they created in some way, but this person created chaos because they're a mess. They were a mess in love with you. So let's take a look at the details of this. All right, so Four of Cups. Four of Cups. This is the energy of being broken up with. Not knowing star. Um, this is the card of Aquarius. I feel like this is the card of, when it's in the reverse, it's um, not knowing what they wanted. So I feel like even though they were experiencing a lot of feelings and love underneath it all, you know, this person just may not have been in good control of their actions. They created this chaos because they might not have known what they wanted, and that ended up in a breakup between the two of you. And ultimately, I feel like this person has thought about you ever since, and you know, they're worried about, I feel like, what happened in the past and what could potentially happen in the future. Let's see. Let's see what they are worried about in the past and what they're worried about in the future. In the past, all right, they're worried about some occurrences between the two of you and, <clears throat> you know, did they have the right intentions? Did they express their intentions properly? but they think about some experiences and memories that they have had with you. And I feel like they're worried that their intentions weren't taken properly. And what they're worried about in the future is, I feel like, moving towards a better place with you. Are they going to be allowed to move towards a better place with you? Um, you know, and get to that better place because this person I feel like had love with you I don't feel like they were great at showing it so what would this person say to you right now look at that I desire drama and chaos <laughs> all right so this is the type of person Clearly, they create a lot of chaos and drama, and they desire it. They're admitting to it, all right? What do we have here? I have freedom from attachment, all right? So I feel like the two of you might be on the outs right now. Um, I, I this Whoever this is, <clears throat> this could be a makeup and breakup type of scenario. And then I have destiny in action here. So this person is probably somebody that feels really good to be around when you when things are good and when things are bad, it's like things couldn't be worse. So this is somebody that creates drama and you might you might be drama yourself. You might have a lot of drama in your life yourself and it creates a chaos. I don't feel like either one of you um feel good when you're in these highs and lows. It's like there's, this person has, I feel like, a need for steadiness. That's why they wanted you in the beginning. That's why they wanted you in the first place, Libra. You bring balance into this person's life, right? That's what Libra is about. So you might be dealing with a fire sign um, who is kind of all over the place, and they're better when they're with you and when you're bringing some type of balance into their life. Um, what is the destiny that's in action here? Two of Pentacles, all right? So games and chaos, but this is leading to what? Queen of Wands, Leo energy, all right? This is... I feel like the games will um, the games will keep us both single. The drama and the chaos will keep us both single. I 
feel like is what this person would tell you. All right. <clears throat> so Libra, that is what I have for you. If you're looking for a deeper, more personal reading, certainly reach out to me. If not, no worries. I will talk to you next time. Thanks so much. Bye.